Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Enigma and you're watching Enigma Inc. So let's do Capricorn for 3 to 14 of um, February. Let's see the messages for your Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. This is a general reading. So take whatever and however this resonates. For more accuracy, you can book a personal reading from me on WhatsApp, Instagram or email me. Okay. Subscribe to my channel for more videos on Capricorn and other signs that you resonate with sun moon rising and Venus signs follow me on instagram for daily monthly and yearly horoscopes and uh, yeah you can also join my workshop on 40 plus white spells gonna help you manifest anything that you want in any phase of your life and it works 101 percent so trust me all those who wants to uh, want to avail those spells can be a part of our workshop and if you want to get a spell done from me that is also available any cheaper remedy is also available with us so do not forget to follow me on instagram for all updates and subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos on this capricorn all right <clears throat> I'll take all of these okay so first of all this is nine of wands okay I feel like you're um actually your move your life has started to move really fast but you do, don't want to you know um, open up too fast there's a someone Libra Gemini Aquarius Aries Virgo Taurus Capricorn might be taking a lot of interest in you i feel like you have a lot of options taking interest in you the more you go gonna go out and meet new people the more options you will get because you're right now being looked upon as one of the most attractive male or female they've ever seen because you're exuding a lot of confidence here i see you you have a very strong sense of self and you make the right judgment and you're very clear about your needs and your wants and that is what actually attracts the opposite sex towards you i feel you're someone who deep who's deep who thinks a lot who knows exactly your boundaries and who doesn't like to mix up with people and who has a lot going on in their life like they see you as someone who's always busy like who's not always feeling alone or you know left out or stuff like that so there's always something or the other going on in, in life. But at the same time, um, I feel like these people feel you're guarded, okay? You're not allowing anybody to come close to you. I do see uh, people might be interested in knowing you more and in that too in terms of marriage, okay? I do see you're a good option for, you know, committing, commitment for these um, people, so they're highly interested in you. Some of you, your person, one of this may be a boss or at a higher position. Another one is at your workplace and then there is someone with whom there is some sort of um, work-related compatibility. But I do see uh, you're seen as someone who's very different from others, Capricorn. This person, like maybe more than one people. But I do see you being the center of attention. And I also see because you're really protective of your heart. You don't want to dwell into these emotions where you might just, uh, you know, um, get upset on little things, you know, ex start expecting things too much. So you just want to focus on self and your money. And I also see your money rising. And I also see like there is some sort of a proposal coming in. This person will tell you um, or, or sing songs for you, do some poetry. And I feel that involves something like soulmate thing happening here. Gemini person interested. I do see three people might be interested in you. Okay. Or if not three, then I do see like someone at your workplace. Okay. Maybe taking a lot of interest in you. And is asking people or your friends your mutual friends about you i do see a major ending happening in your life that was like kind of i feel like you ended a situation or a love situation with someone that was not taking you seriously 
or who did not reach up to your expectations so you kind of ended a love situation with someone maybe they were keeping you in a love triangle and you had to end this and i feel like you've started doing new you started going on for new adventures you know from scratch so you're starting again it's like you're dwelling into love but in an all new fresh energy like starting from zero so i do see right now you might be wanting to be left alone not getting involved with anyone you just want to be with yourself but i do see many people trying to you know get your attention and have you look at them i see like you have beautiful heart you have a sensitive heart and you don't want it to get broken so you want time to you know come out of the past situation completely and accept that it's over and then only you will dive into a new one that is your energy right now so you ended a situation that was keeping you too much in an in and out energy yes this is someone from the past who actually feels like they regret losing you this person might be trying to come towards you from the past okay i feel like that person is very um attracted to you right now the past person who wants to reach out to you and see like how things are going with you because they feel like uh, a loser because they did not reach up to your expectations and they feel a big regret losing you as well aries sagittarius leo scorpio pisces cancer soulmate this person might feel like you're their soulmate but they are not okay false soulmate okay the world you ended this okay this is over i feel like it's time that you are going to manifest your deep wishes things are um coming into fruition whatever you want is coming into fruition i see a lot of options coming in in love life and i do see someone new that you're going to deal with and there are more than one people interested in you okay so you're full of uh, energy right now okay capricorn this is you you're full of energy you're full of excitement enthusiasm and i also feel like your attractiveness has reached another level nine of pentacles like telling me that you are just so happy because there is no feeling of lack there is no feeling of uh scantiness you feel complete because everything that you wanted is already what you have okay is is already there and i see you making a lot of money and you feeling really powerful in your own energy you are exuding a lot of confidence and i feel you are very passionate about your career your work you're going to go a long way i do see you might be getting new projects where you might have to travel but i do see you also leaving a mark wherever you go okay so yeah Okay, I also see that you're going to, you know, gain more knowledge about your work, whatever you're doing. It's it's going to be like you're going to gain more knowledge and your passion is going to take you to places. And I feel if it's about love situation, yes, there is just someone who actually keeping a close eye on you and it's wondering what's going on in your life. I see like many people are interested in you. and you on the other hand are interested in yourself and building a, a name for yourself you know uh, doing something for yourself empress energy is you being super complete independent and powerful in your own energy and all those who are married or all those who are looking for pregnancy then this is a very good time you will get this news and i do see you feeling the whole universe is inside of you you just getting what you want so that is also what i see you just feel like everything is on your feet and you don't need to do anything it just comes on uh, comes to you on its own whatever you want so i do do see that you're going to be achieving big things in life whatever you want it is coming for you patience so you're having a lot of patience and that is how it's going to you know manifest for you like big job or big money or relationship whatever it is happy family yes i do see marriage opportunity i do see like more than one people might be interested in marrying you and have this this person or maybe more than one people are thinking of you know future with you like kids you guys and kids but i do see uh there is like you are in a um, energy of manifesting 
what you want so if you write it down you're going to get that all right this is how your energy is right now so if you write it down whatever you want you're going to get it so yeah the tough cycle has ended and it is a new beginning where you can manifest anything i see like it's like you're starting from scratch and you're being very different from the past and you're having all the new experiences and enjoying the time with yourself listen detach so i do see you feeling detached from emotional you know um destruction so this detachment is going to help you keep emotionally safe and have a boundary a healthy boundary with people around and instead of talking much you're going to listen that's going to help you because you're seeking within i feel like you're becoming more spiritually awakened you are meditating or doing some sort of natural activities like meditating and all that's going to keep you really you know strong now here there's seek two times i feel like you're going to discover yourself finally so you will know who you are you are going you are actually in the phase of discovering your own potential and opening up your door to success finally the doors to success are opening because you're realizing who you are where you come from what you want to be and what is to be done it is safe yeah i feel like you will be loved by people around i also see like you're completely safe and protected by angels this person um whoever is coming towards you i feel like they're going to actually commit to you you would decide who you want to be with so this could be someone at your workplace okay that feels a strong intense passion towards you so i do see yeah there is someone who is feeling strong sense of passion i see more than one people being interested in you now you get to choose who you want to choose money is great what else come to an edge i feel this time you're going to take a big risk when it comes to starting a career of yourself or shifting to another career or a job this will require you to you know take a big risk but that risk is worth it all right i also see in love situation as well you're going to take a big risk and that is going to help you so i'm you 36 here forgiveness you're going to let it go so something from the past that was hurting you are you going to completely end that cycle and yeah there's someone new i feel more than one people from aries to pisces let's see your person how do they feel for you aries please aries is destructive i feel you need to let it go taurus is like slow moving as but not very direction oriented like this person won't stay focused for a long time gemini finds you extremely attractive some of you are in public eyes this person is very attracted to you cancer is feeling a lot of love towards you then we have leo leo is actually hiding something from you so they're not telling you something that you really need to know virgo wants a relationship libra is actually looking for a commitment in the long term virgo do they do virgo um aries taurus gemini uh leo uh gemini cancer leo virgo libra okay scorpio okay the scorpio wants to talk to you come towards you and talk to you and sagittarius um is i feel like willing to help you in in the time of need capricorn wants to end this because i feel this is too difficult to handle and aquarius is having sleepless nights maybe because you ended the situation pisces is ending this because they feel it's not going to go anywhere that's about it uh, capricorn i feel this reading has resonated with you do not forget to like share subscribe and hit the bell and let me know how this resonated till then i will see you next time with more videos on this bye